I get all these emails that say, I'm doing one meal a day. I'm feeling great. I'm just bouncing off the walls. I have lots of energy. I feel good. I'm strong. But I read an article online that said that if you eat once a day, you will raise your blood sugar. And is this true? And I reply back, it's not only not true, it's laughable. When you eat multiple meals, like so many people do, your blood sugar goes up, and then maybe you snack later, your blood sugar goes up again, then you eat another meal, then you, you snack a little bit later, you drink a little soda here, and then you eat your final meal of the day. And it's even worse if they're doing multiple, if they're doing five meals. But that's how your blood sugar looks. Your, your insulin levels raise, which increases fat storage propensity. And the only way to prevent that is to eat a super, super tiny, small portion, which requires more maintenance and is more difficult. On the one meal a day platform, you have your sugar going up for the meal, and then it stabilizes more gradually. And then you have, from 1 to 24 hours, you have a stable blood pattern compared to this, which is, a, which is chaotic. That's why, number one, the fattest people are multiple meal eaters or snackers. The fattest people have cloudiness. They go to work. The people I work with who eat multiple meals, which is pretty much everyone nearly, and they come, we come back from a big meal, they are unfunctional. They cannot do any work because their blood sugars are high and high and high and high. And they really, except when they're sleeping, it never gets a chance to come down. That releases excess cortisol and produces all sorts of problems. One meal a day or you don't have that problem. Your blood sugar if, will level out. Even if you are diabetic, like some of my diabetic clients, your sugar may climb a little bit more initially and drop, and you may have a rougher ride, but eventually with each meal, you're going to get lower and lower. The spike's going to be lower. Your blood sugar is going to look almost completely stable. Once you've done it a while, like I have, your blood sugar is going to be stable. It's a beautiful thing because that's why people write me and say, I feel like I have energy and I don't feel cloudy. And folks, the best high is not a drug-based high. The best high comes from having clarity and, and the ability of your mind to stay in your productive zone. It takes a little bit of adjusting, but one meal is what, is what creates this. Multiple meals and snacking and all the rest of this is what creates this. It's a lot harder to manage when you're doing it in the multiple feedings platform. That, by the way, is why I stress it's important not to exercise when you have a lot of weight to lose. Not exercise beyond a very light cardio like walking because you cut into this blood sugar and when you're on restricted calories, you're going to end up dropping too low. You don't want that. As you increase your calories and you get toward your goal weight, you can increase your activity levels. But your activity levels have to match your blood sugar levels. But your glucose levels, this is where your satisfaction comes from. This is why. For the few articles that are out there on the internet that are trashing one meal a day, very few of them, they are overwhelmed completely by the number of positive emails I get almost every single day without fail that say, thank you, I'm able to think, I'm able to stop binging, I'm able to stop breaking down and, and going into uh, compulsive snacking. That, that's, here's what to thank for that. It's... The, the fact that that's the way you used to eat, and we have learned this multiple meals business. That's the reason society is in such trouble with obesity, because there's too much food. There's not enough control. Self-control is cool. Having low blood sugar is actually cool. And scientific knowledge, as good as it is, is not always going to be with it. It becomes fashionable to hate on certain things. Sometimes it's like that with one meal a day. It's not fashionable, so people will hate on it. The proof is in the pudding. The proof is in the emails I get, and it's in how good you feel each day.